Good morning guys from another video here in Pakistan, specifically in the northern side of Pakistan here in Hunza Valley. And I'm here with the usual squad here. We got the British loud over there sipping a cup of joe. We got the Posh brothers kicking it. And we are here at the uh, Moksha Resorts. Actually, we're checking out this morning and we've had an amazing stay here the last two nights, three days. And uh, it's a really nice time coming up here, guys. Enjoyed it. Good people here. We've had uh, great conversations into the evening. Some of the things off camera, we've just been hanging out, relaxing, sharing stories. And they've been giving us a lot of reasons to come back here in the summer and i'm repeating that in every video because i want you guys to drop a comment and convince me to be back here next summer because we want to see the other side of hunza then the green side it's been awesome though but let me tell you this we've had a lot of warm beverages with us each day and that's done the trick to keep us nice and toasty warm specifically this is a nice coffee to get us going so today we're going to be heading over to the uh, suspension bridge which mr posh is telling us it's one of the most dangerous bridges in pakistan yeah mostly people do not cross that only the locals it's like yeah a scary hanging bridge yeah yeah so this is going to be a bit of an experience basically what i'm being told is between each step as you cross the bridge there are like pretty large gaps like maybe half a foot or maybe what would that be maybe 15 centimeters in between and under it you have a huge drop off you have running water and it's the middle of the winter so if you fall off let's put it this way you're done for so stick with us guys we're going to take a 45 minute road trip from here at the moksha resort over to the suspension bridge and we're going to walk across it i'm being also told that local kids on their way to school they'll run full speed across it so i'm hoping we will get to see that in action so guys for us to eat dinner and breakfast here twice uh for all of us harry and i 4800 so that comes out to just under 25 dollars for some of the best meals that i've had here in pakistan so very very impressed with the food they make here at moksha resorts and if you haven't seen in my other video guys they've actually made pretty much all of their food out of the organic products that are grown here in the mountains in Hunza. So it adds such a special experience knowing that, tasting it and everything else. So very impressed with it. So obviously gotta make sure we hook up our people that took good care of us. Toss some extra in there for them. Shobash, the food was delicious. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. And Shobash to you. Shobash, yeah, the stay was great. Looking forward to coming back here in the summer too. And You're most welcome anytime. Thank you so much. So let us know before you come because in summer we are very busy. Yeah, yeah. So we got to get on the reservation early. We'll talk to the Posh brothers and make sure we can uh, get on the list then. Yeah, <laughs> perfect. I think we're going to get the day started. Yeah, boys? Yes. What do you think? All right, it's time to head over to the uh, suspension bridge. It's going to be pretty adventurous, I can tell you that. And here we go, guys. Another brisk morning. Definitely zero Celsius out today, I can tell you that. But this is one last look at Moksha Resort from outside. That's the building, and you wake up to these picturesque views. You can imagine that all these trees would be nice and luscious green in the summertime. So here we go, we got Mr. Posh number one waiting in the car, ready to go, got it all warmed up. What a man, what a myth, what a legend. We're switching to off-road now, the trek up. Is the rest of the way off-road to the bridge? Yeah. All right, sweet. I would say we're going off the beaten path, but let me tell you this, the path is pretty beaten, so we're not the first people to go here. The uh, cool part about this bridge though is actually built by the locals originally just for them to cross, and now it's turned into such a big tourist attraction, and you guys will find out why very soon. Guys, a bit lost in translation there. Akram said four to five minutes away, but he said it fast, so I thought he said 45 minutes away, but actually, yeah, we're just five minutes away from where our hotel is. So we just arrived to the uh, suspension bridge, Husani, and it's 45 meters high, yeah? and over a hundred meters long. So as you can imagine, it is very large. You guys can see here, I have wings right now. I, I probably look quite funny in the videos. My uh, jacket's just not in the best condition. So we've got uh, the sleeves on, but it's keeping me warm. That's number one most important thing, right? And how far is the walk down to the bridge? Five or six minutes. Five or six minutes. It depends on your steps, how no. you go fast or slow. Oh yeah, we'll wanna go fast so we can warm up. Yeah, if you go like running, it will be more mm. less time. All right, we can go into second gear then. Get some solid speed going, guys. That'll get the uh, blood flowing. Oh. oh, guys, there's the bridge down there. Wow, yeah, that is a long, long bridge. A crime's telling me normally it's uh, quite windy around here. We're lucky because it's probably below zero Celsius right now. I'd say maybe negative five. What'd you say? Yeah, roughly. At night it was uh, minus uh, 11. Minus 11 at night. Oof. Yeah, so it's brisk out here, that's for sure. And so normally he's telling me that it's quite windy. Northern Hunza is known for being quite windy in this area. So the fact that the last couple of days here we've had sun and no wind is just literally like a total blessing that we've been able to do that. Cause that means more drone footage and that means less layers that we have to wear. And already guys, look at how beautiful this is. We're getting more of that picturesque watercolors. We've got a local just cruising right across. Yeah, you really gotta watch your step crossing this one. That's for sure. 
Wow. Avoid crossing the bridge with more than seven people, guys. That's how you know. You gotta be real careful on here. One misstep, you're going through there. I got a little cafe up here too. Looks like we're closed for the season though. Wow. So this is it, yeah? This is the bridge. So over a hundred meters long. And as you can see here, oh, whew. Uh-huh. That's a little sketch. Hello. Wow. So this is the bridge. I will say, I was thinking it was going to be a little higher, so it's not as scary. But uh, that being said, imagine if you fall right down into that river right now. That is ice cold water. Probably the only reason that's not frozen right now is because it is flowing water. But otherwise, it'd be iced. Oh, there's even a boat down there, so I guess you can go for a little cruise maybe. We've got the lad going for a cross here. He's filming it. It's a tweak walking across it. <laughs> How do they run this? This is crazy. Yeah, seriously. Why didn't they add in a few more? Like, it's surely not that hard to add in a few more blocks. Make it not life threatening. All right, guys, we are going to cross it now. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous. I've only stepped out to about like five of the steps and people have fallen off this thing. So you really gotta be careful. We're gonna set you guys right in there. So here we go. Holy, whoo. Really, it's, it doesn't get scary until you start getting close to the water. And then once you're near the water, oh. That is the trick. Uh-huh. Oh. oh, I like being scared. I like being scared though. <laughs> For me, it's a thrill. As you can see, guys, we got running water right under us. One false move, we're taking a polar plunge. I think even Akram's scared right now because he's like, bro, don't focus on the water. <laughs> I'm like, bro, I'm focusing on the water because the more scared I am, the more entertaining it's going to be. Mm -hmm. No, I'm just kidding. He's not scared, guys. He's a local here. He could probably run across it, but I don't want to see it right now because I don't want to have to risk taking him to the hospital. <laughs> As you guys can see here, we've uh, made just a little bit of progress, but uh, still got a long ways to go. I'd say we've made about 20% progress. When you're going over the middle part here, it's not as scary because, I mean, that's a solid fall. You're still gonna fall, I don't know, maybe. But not in the summer, the summer is full of water. Oh, summer it's full of water. All right, we're switching sides here. Uh huh. The sound of the water makes it scary. Ah, yeah. So there's much less water right now. So as you guys can see, you gotta be careful crossing it. Yeah, just imagine this in the summer, we would just have so much rushing water under under us. Although the thing is, if you fall in in the summer, as long as you don't like get hurt, you just fall right into the water. Whereas like, I guess now if you fall in, you're gonna like have hypothermia, destroy all of our electronics. You can see someone drop his gloves. Oh, someone dropped their gloves. Yeah, that's definitely not something I wanna drop with how cold it is. How long did this take to build? Probably a month, two months. A month or two months, wow, that's all? I expected way more. Now we're getting over the sketchy side. Got a bigger gap there to cross. We're gonna switch sides there, guys. There we go, we have switched sides. Oxrum's just running across right now, as you guys can see. Uh-huh. I don't know how the local kids just run right across. I wish I could see one. Oh, this is a big step. Look at this one, guys. Ah. You know, guys, they say face your fears. Never knew I was scared of these types of bridges until I'm walking over the river. <laughs> how you doing back there, hair man? I'm surviving, brother. Uh-huh. He's just holding on for dear life and, and onto that GoPro for dear life. You best believe if I'm falling in, this GoPro's coming with me. We're about halfway. Uh-huh. That's where we're at, guys. This part's safe, yeah? So should we pick up the speed? Oh, look at this one. They wanted to make this one a little more complex. Oh, 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 oh. There it is. Here, let's shake the bridge a little bit here. We got Mr. Candy shaking the bridge. Uh-huh. Got to make it a little more dangerous, right, guys? Don't want the hair man to think it's this easy to cross the suspension bridge. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, now it's like you're wobbling, guys. Here we go. Oh, we're speeding up now. Uh-huh. You can call me a local at this point. It's actually quite peaceful once you get over the fear factor of you're walking across a dangerous bridge. How many of the tourists you take on tours usually cross the bridge? All of them? Not, not, not. Like 50%? Uh, 70. 70%. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, I almost missed a step there. Yeah, now we're getting really close to the ground. You can almost touch the ground here in just a second. Then it gets a little less scary, that's for sure. You think we can touch the ground from here? Uh, probably about seven foot. So probably not. No. I was thinking about climbing down. I've always got these absolutely brilliant ideas and that was one of them, but I guess we'll skip it for today. I think the view looking this way looks better. I mean, beautiful both ways, but 
Oh, that's a big one. That is a big one. Let's get this backpack on a little more. It's falling off. We've got the major river to cross now, guys. The biggest part of it. Uh-huh. Geez, Akram's basically already over there. And he stopped for videos. I guess it's really not as scary walking over this river because you can see the bottom. Like, it's very shallow. At least right here, it looks like it is. But when you go uh, further into the season when there's more water, like, then it might be a bit more scary. Although, if you fall in such shallow water, there's a good chance you'll break a limb. So, I don't know how well you'll be swimming. And it looks like we have some sort of sewer or water pipe that's running across the bridge here. And, oh, we got quite the gap here, guys. Oof. Oh, yeah, and we're making it. Good progress, good progress. The hands are getting a little chilly though. I will say the hand holding the GoPro is much colder than the one holding the bridge because I'm just sliding it across, gripping onto it, which is probably warming it up because it's requiring a little bit of strength to hold on for dear life. Oh, and I feel like the steps just get smaller here. We're going uphill. Look at this one. Uh-huh. Oh, baby, baby. This is how it gets insane. Yeah, guys, you see that one, one wrong step? It is time to go swimming. We are almost there. I will say, towards the end here, it gets a little more challenging because we've got uh, some bigger steps and the ropes, as you can see on the side, are more like up to the height of my shoulders now rather than they were more like halfway to my waist before. Uh-huh. We are making progress. Living on the edge right now, guys. No pun intended. And here we go. Well, we've got the finish line right there. You know, we don't want to get trigger happy here, though, because the last steps can sometimes be the most dangerous. Dun, dun, dun. Yes. Success. <laughs> Alas. Alas. And we've got the British coming in third place. Ha, <laughs> ha. Wouldn't expect anything less. You made me wait. Ha, <laughs> ha. Yeah, now he says it. We made it. Huzzah. As you can see, guys, this is the old unit holding it down. Seems like they've got her cemented in quite well. Bridge seems uh, quite sturdy. We've got suspension points from all over here. And even when I was wobbling around, it wasn't as shaky as I was expecting. Like I could see maybe if you had like 10 people running across there, it might be, but like us three on there and just shaking the bridge a little bit, it wasn't too scary. It's just those big steps over the river that are like, whoa, you really got to watch your step here. So there's always time for a gym session. No days off the gym, guys. <laughs> ah. Yeah, let's get to a safe spot to get up. Cheers, brother. Guys, that's what I call a solid workout here on the suspension bridge. That will keep us going. And it warmed up the entire body. Got the blood flowing. Got the uh, hands warmed up because I'm holding onto this wire for dear life. I think we might have some locals here. I'm not sure if they're tourists. No, they're tourists. Yeah, because they're getting photos. I was hoping we were going to see the locals just sprint across, guys. Hello! Pakistan! Zindabad! Abkanam Kayahe! Pakistan! Zindabad! We're getting the locals hyped up. We'll see if we get them to cross. Come on over! They're from Lahore. Yeah, they're from Lahore? Yeah, from Lahore. I think they were the ones we saw taking selfies in the streets. <laughs> They made their way over to the bridge. Are we going for the drone shots? Oh yeah. oh yeah. As you guys can see, once you get over to the other side here, this is the way the locals walk. You got a, a ridge right along there. That's probably how they get over there. Unfortunately, we're limited on time, so we won't be taking you guys over there. This is a nice little beach here. We can just imagine like, wow, the water must be like maybe up to there because you can kind of see how it's starting to dry out there. But very cool. We got people way down there considering crossing. These landscapes, guys, though, there's something else. I can't get over them. Well, now that I'm a veteran, I can cross this thing easily. Hopefully no one borrowed my sleeves over there that I left. So as you guys can see, I'm sleeveless from my main jacket. Turned it into a vest. We've got the hair man getting the drone ready. We've got locals crossing from the other way. Oh, already almost tripped. The hair man's getting the drone up now as we cross. Gotta watch out. Never know if these locals are gonna shake the bridge. Pockets are zipped, making sure. Hello! Where are you from? TK, Ab We've got everyone crossing now. We've got the hair man with the drone up. Watch out for those, bro. Jeez, I don't remember this one being so big right here. Oh, oh this step's kind of like rounded. That makes it a bit sketch. All right, seems like we got, we've got a uh, local cross in here. Salam alaikum. Pakistan. Zindabad! Abkesehe! 
ठीक है ठीक है इंजॉय करने आए हैं इंजॉय घूमने घूमने पाकिस्तान यस यस आपका नाम क्या है उमर 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 मैक नाइस टू मीट यू यस यस एंड मैंने पाकिस्तान यस 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 वेरी नाइस बर्ड वाचिंग यस 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 वेरी नाइस वेरी नाइस थैंक यू सर या वी आर वी आर जस्ट ओवर मी एंड ओमर वी आर वी आर एक्चुअली राइट अबव रनिंग वाटर यस या 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 इट्स अ ब्यूटीफुल प्लेस हियर ओके और मेरा दोस्त है वो लंदन से आया लंदन से गोगरे गोरे को है ना ओह परफेक्ट ओह यस थैंक यू वो भाई है तुम Yeah, yeah. Yes. Thank you so much. Okay, thank Good, you, sir. Goodbye, oh. my friend. Yes, yes. Goodbye. Yes. I must say, shaking hands on a uh, bridge with one hand with a GoPro and one hand on the on the uh, wire is a little sketchy, but uh, not gonna miss out on a handshake with a nice local here. All right, we are making good progress here. This guy's going rather quick. He's done this before. Salam alaikum. Ab kaise hai? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. ठीक है ठीक है गाइस द प्लेस गॉट प्रीटी बिजी हियर द सन स्टार्टिंग टू कम आउट सो इट्स वार्मिंग अप अ बिट आई एम गेटिंग मोर कॉन्फिडेंट वॉकिंग अक्रॉस वॉकिंग बैक मेकिंग सम प्रीटी क्विक प्रोसेस हियर ओ दैट्स अ बिग लिटिल गैप देयर रमन यू ओके हे हाउ आर यू ब्रदर आई एम डूइंग गुड मैन हाउ आर यू डूइंग गुड गुड आई एम फ्रॉम द यूएस माय फ्रेंड ओवर देयर इज फ्रॉम द यूके नाइस टू मीट यू मैन यू ओके नाइस टू मीट ओ लेट मी पुट दिस देयर इट्स अ बिट टफ सो इज माय फैमिली Oh, your whole family here, yeah? So I come, I came from UK for about three weeks. Oh, nice. We're about in the UK. I'm from, I'm from London. I'm from London, nice. Yeah, from London, and then we're just touring the north of Pakistan. Yeah. So we, uh, I think we're spending today in Hunza, then we're heading down to a place called Chiras. Chiras, yeah. And then from there, yeah. we're heading to uh, Swat. Oh, Swat, yeah. We were in Swat like five days ago. We've been in Pakistan for almost four weeks now. Nice. And How so, are you finding it? Oh, amazing, amazing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's no, been amazing. beautiful. A little cold in Hansa. They're definitely going to come back here in the summer. Yeah, it's so. Even my friends, my family, they were saying that because we got here yesterday, yesterday, yeah. innit? Yeah. There's no greenery. Everything. Yeah, yeah everything's but dead right the now. The way my cousin sold it to us, he was saying that when in the summer when you come, you can pick apples from the trees. Yeah, yeah and peach apples, uh, and apricots, apricots too. Yeah, yeah. Cherries, all of this amazing yeah. stuff. Yeah. This is how they sold it to it sold it to us, but, but it's yeah. still beautiful. I'm not gonna yeah, lie. it is. This view, everything is beautiful. Yeah, it's incredible. Have man. you done everything else? In, when did you reach Hunza? Oh, uh, like four days ago. So we were in Hunza Central. Then we did like Lake Atbah yeah, yesterday. Yeah. Did some jet skiing, some boating. Yeah, amazing. Yeah, yeah. So it's been good. Yeah. What's your good name, bro? Ibrahim. Ibrahim, nice Mac, you, nice to meet yeah, you. Yeah. Come eat with us. We're gonna we're gonna go for some food after. Oh, so come eat with us. Honestly, would love to, but yeah. we're on our last day here, and then we're road tripping Last back day. to Islamabad, and we're with a ah, tour okay. guide, so we kind of have a set plan. Okay, okay, okay. But cool, uh, are you YouTubing? YouTuber, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, what's your YouTube? Yeah, I got the uh, a card here. You know, we got cards just in case when we're crossing <laughs> suspension bridges, you don't have to pull out your phone. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, good job. Yeah, yeah. Assalamu alaikum. Ab kaise hai? I'm fine. How are you? Ah, uh, very good. Yeah, well, cool, gentlemen. I will. Yeah, nice uh, to meet you, man. Yeah, nice to meet you too. Likewise, man. Take care. Have it's a nice pleasure. Trip. You too. Nice to meet you. Right. Take care, guys. Oh, this is great, guys. Now that it's getting busier, we're uh, meeting people from around the world as we cross the bridge. We've got Harry flying the drone right under, and oh. making solid progress guys i will say when the sun comes out it gives you that extra boost of confidence where you can walk this fast uh huh that's the way uh huh uh huh we cross it uh huh uh huh that's the way uh. all right we're doing it real quick here salam alaikum wa alaikum salam ab kaise hai theek zabardast theek theek guys we're starting to pick up a little bit of urdu here enough to uh you know give a nice friendly welcoming oh that step is loose here we go Uh-huh. 
Oh, uh huh, uh huh. We're definitely leaning this way. Got to switch sides with a bro here. We got him taking, taking a strong lean this way. Whoa, we got the drone coming right over us, guys. Oh yeah, we're going over the water again. Next body of water. We got two more rivers to cross and we're back. We got our buddy here holding on for dear life. I don't blame you, boss. That was me on the way over. Guys, we're getting pretty good at this. I don't want to get too confident because as soon as you get too confident, then that's when something happens. Salam alaikum. Wa alaikum as salam. Ab kaise hai? Shukr Allah, ka aap sunao. Theek hai, alhamdulillah. Good. Good, good. All right. We're almost back here. Oh, yeah, you can see, guys. Now the, the wire's almost up to my head here. So we got to switch over to this one. Pakistan! Zindabad! How are you, dude? How are you, man? How are you? Hey, great, brother. How are you? We got the hype squad. Ah, got the hype squad cheering us on to make the final journey across. Okay. Here we go, here we go. Guys, it's turning into a peaceful day actually. It's sunny out. I've said that like 10 times, but trust me guys, I just have something. I'm just saying words right now to uh, keep the last couple steps. <laughs> Fear out of my head. Ooh, you can see directly what we're walking over here, guys. As they say, don't look down. Oh Shukriya yaar. You like Pakistan? Love Pakistan. Pakistan! Zindabad! Yaar. 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 Ab kaise hai yaar? Theek hai? Theek hai? Ab ka naam kya hai? Wasim. Wasim, that's a great name. And you? Kasim. Kasim, that's a great name. And you? My name is Akil. Akil. Great name. And you? Ahmed. Ahmed, great name. Hamda. Hamda. Like Hamdala. That's a great name. What are you feeling? Oh, we got wires here, guys. We got wires here. We've got, uh, hold on, we got to see where the drone is. Is it done? It might what do be you done. think about it, Pakistan? Pakistan is one of the most beautiful countries I've ever been to. As you guys can see in the background here, it speaks for itself. And the hospitality here is to a whole nother level. Where are you guys from? We are from Pakistan. Lahore, Pakistan. Lahore yeah? Oh, and Punjab? Yeah. yeah, very good cities. Great people there. Lahore has some of the best food in Pakistan. Yeah. Thank you, thank yeah. you. Have you guys been to uh, Meet the Cheese? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's Tige. Very Tige. So we got the boys here from Lahore and Punjab. Yeah. And yes. uh, that's where you're originally from? Lahore. Pakistan. All from Lahore. We are all, 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 from Lahore. Uh, yeah. we are all brother together. All brothers. Uh, ah, brother, yeah. brother, brother. Brothers. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. One more. That is great. Pakistan. Zindabad. That is a good one, guys. You can hear it echoing through the landscapes right now into the mountains. As you guys can see, we have a, a, a local person crossing here and he's not even holding on. Wow. Looks like he's carrying a bunch of sticks across and he's just taking each step. When you get used to crossing this thing, you know which steps to take and which ones to watch out for, that's for sure. Assalamu alaikum. Hello. How are you? Good. You're very good at walking across the bridge. Yes, of course. Yeah, you didn't hold on. My practice like this. I'm Jawed Iqbal. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Alhamdulillah. Shukriya, my friend. Thank you. Yeah, guys, so we've got some bad news though. After Harry was doing some filming, he uh, lightly crashed his drone and the drone actually uh, recovered from the crash. But since Harry was on the side of the river, he couldn't see that. And so it was just hovering there for a second. I didn't know that he didn't realize that it didn't fully crash. And he didn't know that it was still flying. So the drone basically followed the uh, process of returning to home. And then he was crossing the bridge thinking that once he saw the drone near the river, it was my drone being flown. And by the time he got across, I was like, no, dude, like your drone flew back. And then they went looking for it. And it sounded like some of the other people over there had said it was hovering over the top of the river and it must have just plunged once it ran out of battery. And of course, the current's pretty strong in the river, especially those drones are so lightweight that it pulled it down the current. So I spent 45 minutes looking for it and uh, no luck. So rest in peace to Harry's drone here. The biggest thing you guys can do, go to his channel, share some of his videos, like them, share it with your friends. Hopefully that'll help him recover the $2,000 he just lost on that drone. But uh, those things happen when you travel and when you get those risky shots. So that's, that's part of it. So guys, looks like we're paying after because the place wasn't open earlier. Entry fee to cross, 100 big ones. So basically uh, entry fee, 100 comes out to probably 70 cents, I would say. And this is the uh, ticket we get. We're number 12592. 
Husani suspension bridge. That's where I'm gonna go ahead and end today's video, guys. Hope you enjoyed like, the uh, adrenaline of us crossing the bridge this morning. It was a lot of fun outside of Harry crashing his drone. Look forward to sharing more adventures with you guys here in the next upcoming video. As you can see, I'm out of breath. It's the perfect time to tell you guys to smash that like button so I can continue this journey back to the car and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on the next journeys around the world. See you tomorrow.